Patrick, lovely to meet you. <laughs> lovely to see you again. Same to you, <laughs> So, um, Patrick, you're a director. I am indeed. What does a director actually do? In a word, a director makes people want to do what you want them to do. In order for that to happen, you've got to know what it is you want them to do, and you've got to have a reason for that. So you've actually got to work out why you want to do what you want to do in order to persuade people that that's exactly what they want to do. Mm. So you think preparation is key? More than that, it's, it's a whole key of directing. Uh, just occasionally some people would say to me, you know, can I follow you, watch you directing? And I go, no. And they got a little bit sad. I said, there's no point. All you'll see me is running around shouting, action, cut, and basically showing off, which is what I do a lot of. But what they don't see is the actual directing. In other words, they don't know why I'm doing what I'm doing. If they wanted to really know uh, what I was doing, they should sit by me at my desk as I'm preparing the show over a matter of hours, weeks, or months sometimes, uh, because that's where real directing happens. What, what are the biggest mistakes that directors make? Biggest mistakes? Well, first of all, most directors haven't bothered to work out what screen acting is. With the result is they don't know how to make actors act better for the screen. And so they fall back on, oh, let's make it truthful. As if the truth had anything to do with screen acting, which it doesn't. And I certainly go into that in my courses. You teach a rain dance. Uh, what's the course you teach? I teach hands-on directing part one and part two as well, which is much more advanced. Now, I've, I've been very privileged to see a lot of your courses and a lot of the students, when they come out, say, you know, I, I spent three years at film school and I've learnt more in two days with you than I did in those three years. Um, what is it you actually do? Well, it's all, <laughs> the answer's in the title, hands-on, because I actually get people to do things. Uh, I was watch, working out that um, I've, done a, I've been working for Rain Dance now for 18 years at this moment. And during that time, I've done 140 different courses for them, uh, 80 of which were two-day courses. So it's a lot of time I've spent here. Mm. And during the time I've been presenting those courses, I've also done 25 theatre productions and 45 uh, I, uh, episodes or of one feature film, one Russian sitcom, 45 screen things that have gone on. Mm. In other words, I'm teaching what I know. I'm teaching what I do. And I try to teach what people actually do, what directors actually do, the very question you asked me. And I let people experience it and work it out because there's no... Books will tell theory. What they don't do is tell practice. Now, I started directing back in late 1970s. I know when I did the BBC uh, film course, it was very simple. I wrote to the BBC and pointed out how wonderful I was. And they took me on and trained me and paid me a salary. And before you get too excited, I uh, actually was interviewed by the BBC and they turned me down. Oh. And the next year, and the next year, and the next year. And after 11 years of constant rejection, they took me on. Oh. A friend of mine said, you lucky, lucky person. I said, what do you mean? He said, I tried for years to get in that course. I said, how long? He said, seven years. I said, what did you do then? He said, I gave up. I went, aha. This was your big mistake. <laughs> You've got to keep going at it. And things don't happen quickly. Uh, and I did my little film. And to my utter surprise, it wasn't brilliant. It was good, but it wasn't brilliant. So I went home in a rage and wrote a sharp letter to myself, pointing out my deficiencies. And the next time I did a shoot, I did the same thing. And I've done it ever since. I now have a nice thick file of notes from me to me. And funnily enough, the courses that I do and the stuff that I do for Rain Dance are based upon what I've learned doing it, not what I think might be a good idea theoretically.